Hi, I'm David Casuto from San Francisco Computer Tutors, and in this tutorial we're going to show you how to add a jump menu. A jump menu is when you have basically a drop-down menu of various choices. Uh, if you're creating a survey or something like that, or if you want to um, find out what state is somebody from, something like that, it's very useful for forms. So we're going to show you how to do that. I'll show you how easy it is in just a few minutes. Okay, we're going to ask the eternal question of who is your favorite beetle? Okay, and then we're going to get some choices for that. So how do we actually create this jump menu? So come up to the top and we'll see we see insert. And then down somewhere in the middle you're going to see it says form. Okay, because this is part of the form menu. And then you're going to see a whole bunch of different form elements come up. And we're going to go down to jump menu. Okay, it's that easy. And now we're going to see we have a few different choices here, our menu items and then text. So it's basically asking us to put in the text of what our menu items are going to be. So basically I'm just going to put in John, and then I'm going to hit the plus sign. So item 1 is now going to change from item 1 to John. And then um, under text again I'm going to say Paul, and then guess what? I'm going to hit plus. And then I'm going to say Ringo, hit plus, and then I'm going to see guess who? George. Okay, and then I'm going to hit plus. Now, you could also put it in a different order if you like. Okay, see we have these up and down arrows. Okay, you want George up on top, maybe. Okay, or you want John to move down a little bit. Can okay, you see, notice it moves down every time. So now you also have, when selected, okay, if I actually click on John, okay, what should the URL be? Okay, once you actually choose it, do you want it to go to another page, for example? Okay, so um, that's something you can do. I'm not going to do it in this case. And then you also have down at the bottom here, um, insert a go button after the menu. So after it's selected, you can say, okay, now click go. So I'll go ahead and do that. Why not? Okay, and then if you are going to do go, then you should actually put in, a, um, put in a URL. So let me go ahead and do that now that I think about it. So HTTP, okay, forward slash, forward slash, www. And we'll go to storystreet.net just for fun and then click OK. So let's go ahead and preview that in our browser because right now we can't actually see it. So we actually need to use, we need the browser to allow us to see it. So let's go ahead and come up here to our globe and then preview it in Safari. And then we're going to save our changes. Yes, thank you. And now it says, pop quiz, who is your favorite beetle? And just like that, I see George, Paul, Ringo, and John. Okay, and there's John and then I click go and it takes me right to Story Street. Okay, well that concludes our exercise on uh, uh, creating jump menus using Dreamweaver. Um, you see how easy that was and how fun it was. And uh, once again, I am David Casuto from San Francisco Computer Tutors. And you can look me up on Yelp.com under San Francisco Computer Tutors. And uh, feel free to give me a jingle anytime. Thanks.